right, coming up next, it's a lightweight championship fight between Khabib Nurmagomedov and Dustin Poirier. All right, here he is, the number one lightweight contender, making his way to the octagon and looking to lead as the new undisputed UFC lightweight champion of the world. He has bided his time, waiting for this title shot. He's got the winning streak. He has the quality of opposition. Now he's fighting the number one guy in the world. He believes he's the best. Now his opportunity to prove it just a few minutes away. As he makes his way towards this cage, he believes this is his time. He believes he is destined to take this title. His preparation for this bout has gone absolutely according to plan. He's in fantastic shape with a great game plan, and he expects to walk out of this cage tonight as the new champion. All right, here's the UFC lightweight champion of the world defending his belt yet again. This has been one dominant 155-pound fighter, ladies and gentlemen. You know this is a belt that frequently changes hands. Well, it hasn't since it's been wrapped around this guy's waist, given all the skills he brings to the table. The question is, fighting a challenger like this, can he hold on to the belt? If he can, just another chapter in the greatness of one of the best lightweights this octagon has ever seen. The champion is in focus right now. He's making his way towards the cage. His training for this bout has been perfect. Everything ran according to plan. He believes he has a solid game plan, and he's ready to step in here and retain his title. And now our kill the tape for this lightweight scrap. Both fighters, 29 years of age. Nurmagomedov is one inch taller. Poirier will have the two inch reach advantage. All right, now for the official introductions, we set it inside the octagon to Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the Saitama Super Arena in Tokyo, Japan. It's time! Five rounds for the undisputed UFC Lightweight Championship of the World. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a boxer, holding a professional record of 24 wins, five losses, and one no contest. He stands five feet nine inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of Coconut Creek, Florida, presenting the challenger, Dustin the Diamond Boyer. And now introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a grappler, holding a professional record of 27 wins, no losses. He stands 5 feet 10 inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of the Republic of Dagestan, Russia, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC lightweight champion of the world, Habib the Eagle. All right, this is for the championship. You've been giving your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. This, this is a fight that we have been looking forward to for a long time and is about to take place right now. I'm very excited. You ready to fight? You ready? All right, here we go. Will we crown a new UFC lightweight champion here tonight? It is time to find out. Able to land to the body there with the left kick. Now he goes for the single leg. Wow, that was a quick takedown. And now is where things could get really interesting. He tries to pass here, but gets shut down. 
And the fighters engage in the clinch here right out of the shoot. Oh, he pummels there. Now he's got double underhooks. And there comes the separation now. Huge block there. Just missed with the left there. Poirier gets caught by the inside leg. Sniff that one out as he blocks the kick. Splits the guard and connects with the punch. Well, that's not what you're looking for defensively. He moved right into that hook, and his opponent wisely lands it to the body there. He has been increasingly more susceptible to that strike. Let's see if that one gets his attention. And he lands a nice kick. They have started this fight off with a brawl. Wow! The champion is in big trouble here. He is in danger of losing his title. He's got him hurt here. This fight is dangerously close to being stopped. Big oh. over here. Oh, he got flipped there. He got hurt. Really swung for the fences with that hook, but misses. Oh! How about that chin? Oh, he is just teeing off here. Oh! Body kick, look at that. Oh! oh he's him. Him. He's out cold. Do you believe it? What power that guy has in his hands. Yeah, there's another one for the highlight reel, Joe, and that's probably as good a knockout as he's had in the UFC. Just a perfect shot to end the fight. Crowd absolutely loving it. Flush land to close out his opponent. I'm not even sure the other fighters saw it coming. So a big knockout for him here tonight on the biggest of stages. Watch this again here. Boom! And then he's out. And there is the UFC lightweight champion. He is going to be a hard guy to buck off the throne, getting it done by way of knockout here tonight. What a finish on the sport's biggest stage. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop to this contest at two minutes, three seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by... been talking about those two words throughout fight week and new UFC champion. He completes the mission here tonight, and you can see the emotion spilling over. Absolutely incredible what this fighter was able to accomplish, and it is going to take a special performance to dethrone the new UFC champion of the world.